this chump change, I'm gonna knock a bad, grown and sexy bitch if I ain't got a fat peas pizaki. Who you trying to impress? Your auntie Denise, with all that ass nigga, she got ass. She grown, yeah. She grown into a fucking idiot. Nah, she's sexy. Sexy? She more like obsessed with sex, nigga. Nah, mad for the penis. That's exactly how I like my women. Shit, it's good to be home. What's up? Can a low come up in your crib? Man, fuck you. I see you at work. Oh, nigga, don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe if you got rid of that old yee yee ass haircut you got, you get some bitches on your dick. Oh, better yet, maybe Tanisha will call your dog ass if she ever stop fucking with that brain surgeon, the lawyer she fucking with, nigga. What? Oh, motherfucker. Ooh, honey. <laughs> Y'all telling me? Oh, he here. We living on top of each other, and it ain't right. Shoo! Shoo! Get on out of here! Okay, baby. I see you at the thing. You here? I was on the phone, boy. Don't be listening. Goddamn freeloader.
They're not running that. They're smoking it. Or so I hear a dangerous new Why you got to make all that racket? Toilet cleaner. And believe me, your toilet will be cleaned after you've smoked some of it. Can you please be normal of today, course, Auntie? Vinewood being Vinewood. It's not all about well, if it isn't my favorite slash only blood relative. Up gangbangers stuck in some 90s time warp. Stay normal this now, Auntie D. Hey, Auntie, please act normal just for once. Of course, to become truly popular, your murder has to be both unsolved and gruesome. In a town full of alien spotters, adults dressed as zombies, and entertainers dressed as cartoon characters, it takes something particularly awful to really catch people's attention. The famous unsolved murder of a Vinewood starlet is one such case. For years, horny nerds have wondered what happened to Leonora Johnson, and if they would have plucked up the courage to speak to her or kill her themselves. Man, I got to get some it's real fucking bangers. Copycat killer. This shit is so fucking me. It blame. can't touch me. The Nothing can touch me because I don't feel any fucking way. Because I'm if. But not all crime is premeditated. Maybe drinking's your thing. Look at this drunken buffoon proving that there doesn't always need to be criminal intent to cause serious <laughs> criminal damage. Or maybe you're just an overprivileged poppycock. Living on daddy's pension and protesting about the unfairness of capitalism. Maybe stock market manipulation is your bad. That's not real weed. That does that nothing for me, shit. I can't feel swinging. anything. Nothing. Uh, I can't even feel my fucking toes right now. Damn, my toes are fucking dead. My toes are dead. Or my soul. What the fuck is it? Something is very dead. Hey, what's going Hey, boy, liquidity is a bitch. Get over here so I can give you the new repo list. All right, dog. I'll be around when I get a chance. Nice to see you, darling. Hey, Tyrus, how are you, big brother? Woo! That's a star good yeah i like it now i'm telling you if you don't sleep in that hairnet you're gonna wake up with your brains in your pillow dig all right i hear you see ya come in come in what do you have in mind
Thanks for stopping by. What's good? Hey, what's up, Simeon? My dear boy, so good to see you. So good. Hold me. <laughs> yeah, look, man. Look, we've been working together for about a few months now, right? Which is why I am very honored to announce to you that you are employee of the month. Huh? Anyway, congratulations. It wasn't easy picking a winner. <laughs> yeah, me, Lamar, your nephew Sacha with the twitch. Look, man, it's been a real honor, homie. But I gotta move forward in my life. It seems like all I do is let people tell me what to do and I do it and nothing changes. I tell you what, my boy. You tell me exactly what you want and I will very carefully explain to you why it cannot be. What? Today is repossessing vehicles that fools have purchased at exorbitant interest rates. But tomorrow, together, <laughs> I never had a black son. But if I did, I want him to be just like you. Knock, knock, ah. nigga. <laughs> Hello, What's up, Lamar. Sydney? What's up, homie? What's up, Lenovo? What's up, dog? Franklin here has been awarded Employee of the Month. You fucking with me, right? Man, we both being fucked with, dog. Man, knock it off, man. For real, after all the motherfucking work I put in, man. Man, fuck this Employee of the Month shit, homie. I'm sitting up here trying what to get What you mean, us... fuck this employee of the month shit, man? When there's some shit to be won, goddammit, I want it. I don't give a fuck what it is. You know what I'm talking about? I take no prisoners. I go hard doing this shit. Big dog, big nuts. When names is on the motherfucking board, I want to see my name at the top of that motherfucker next to it. It needs to say, winner. <laughs> hey, maybe next month, huh? Man, fuck next month, Simeon. What about today? I, I demand a retrial. Today is nothing. Just a bike. Hasn't made a payment at all. Some kid at Vespucci Beach. His name is Esteban Jimenez. Is he in a gang? Curiously enough, I did not inquire when he bought the bike. <laughs> we got work to do, uh, employee of the month. Man, fuck you and come on. Man, you was about a yes master ass nigga. What we waiting for? Magellan Ave, nigga. Best beauty beat. At least you had that old raggedy ass Harry style. I was about to have to drop your ass. Man, fuck you, nigga. I wish I had to cut it. You drop it. Hey, wasn't that motherfucker who took the bike that S.A. Vagos dude? With the tattoo on his face and shit? Yeah, that was him. Fuck, homie. I don't want no unnecessary bullshit here, all right? Nigga, I don't give a shit. It's a reason Simeon pays a couple of mean-looking motherfuckers to come repo this shit. We ain't Girl Scouts. In your case, I ain't so sure about that. Man, step up, nigga. Of course... You ain't see that? Of course this dude real. Who else gonna have to require a surplus of paper and deficiency of brain cells? He just put a dub down on this bike. 20 Gs? 
with a 3G note? Damn, that motherfucker must be tricked out, dawg. Man, this whole setup designed to take drug money. All right, man, look, we go in quiet. In and out, no fucking drama. I'll try, homie, but I'm one loud, dramatic, brass, crazy, greedy, shooter motherfucker in the back type motherfucker. And you love me for it, nigga. <laughs> That's right, homie. Nothing but love, nigga. I'd send me the funny dude, though. Uh, it's gonna be a shame when we get to book his ass and jack him for all this shit. What the fuck you talking about? You a psychotic motherfucker. That's how shit work, ain't it? You do some jobs for a fool, develop a little uneasy relationship, and then they ask you to do something above and beyond. You fall out, fools get capped, and then you start all over again with some other fool. Where the fuck you get that from? That ain't my life, dummy. How about the boy with the eye from around the way? Marcus or something, you were slanking for him, and then he got what was coming, right? That was different. That dude had it coming. I don't want to clap my boy and Terry in either. I like homie. It's just smacks of the inevitable. Look, dog. this time we legit, homie. This honest work is going to end up with us coming up in the world. Oh, really? That's a nice change from fools coming up on us. That's trio, homie. You damn straight that's trail, partner. But it's a shame I don't believe it. You want to drop some notes on that shit? I'll give you the eyes, homie. You Apache motherfuckers love y'all best, huh? You should go work on one of them reservation casinos. The bike should be in one of the lockups down here. Should be is the story of your life, asshole. I'm gonna make this look easy. <laughs> Think this crazy motherfucker wants something. Hey, what's up, homie? You all right? No, wait, wait! Wait, my man! Perfect sample agents! Uh. Ah! Yeah, you thought I was gonna hit your bitch ass, huh? Drunk ass nigga. Shit, man. Play it cool. Yeah, that's right. Keep it moving, bitch. I mean, I don't like this shit one bit. Hey, look, let's keep it smooth, homie. Man, your pussy the only thing that's smooth up in this shit. Man, what exactly did I do in the past life to deserve your stupid ass? This is a routine lick, dawg. Chill. Do them Vagos look routine? This a shady ass app. Shit, we in Best Beauty Beach. We on the wrong side of Best Beauty Beach. You should know a block makes a difference. Hey, 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 hold up. Got to be in one of these motherfuckers. Man, ain't this spot a bitch? Ain't no motherfucking bike in here, man. No shit, nigga. Hola, amigos. Hola, SA. Uh, so you trying to creep up in here, man? Yeah, you saw this motherfucker? Oh, shit. Yo, yo. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh. Fuck. Fucking die. Come on down, everybody. Come on down. Hey, nigga, I would've just got my ass beat over a fucking gun fight. Man, stop being a pussy, nigga, and grab that heat. Get that out of my way. Check my luck, homie. Yeah. Find your bitch ass and come. Get the fucking head down. Motherfuckers got us closed in here. Get in behind that truck, homie. They got me pinned down, shoot that gas can! Follow me, let's get through this. Somebody tell them niggas this illegal repossession. You make friends wherever your ass go, nigga. There's a fool on the balcony. You can fuck bad man. Up there, shoot that nigga. Bust his ass. Over there, they coming out that door. They trying to fail me in that ride. Barely, homie. Shit, we gotta get the fuck away from this shit. Man, we only came here for a bite. And that a motherfucker is right there. Hey, nigga, come here. We got your pink slip. May as well get this shit done. We really gonna reap for after all this bullshit. Let's get him, homie. I wanna get paid. Paid ain't worth shit when you're doing 25 with an L. We massacred those motherfuckers. Shit. This punk get away, we going down, homie. He gonna pin us for all these bodies. 
And whose fault is that, Mr. Hades action? Fuck! Mr. Hades action movie body count motherfucker. Don't play the blame game, just get on this shit. Man, you lost him already. That's a monster fucking bike you riding, stupid. Because he's sitting on 140 cubic inches right there, nigga. Oh shit, Professor, you're right. Look out! Now watch that shit, homie. Man, you are a coordinator. Couple of scratches better than nothing. Get that bike back. Man, oh, sorry shit, about that. Dog, we gotta lay low. Get the bike and meet me at the car wash on Innocence. Be cool, my nigga. Man, I can't hang with your ass for a while, bro. You a psychopath. You done finally fucking lost it. Nigga, that's that Apache blood in me, homie. You ain't lucky I ain't do a flying tomahawk and scalp they motherfucking ass. We can't repo the assets of a dead man, big sitting chief asshole. Nigga, and we ain't going to neither, nigga. I'm gonna keep this motherfucker for myself. Tell Simeon we couldn't recover. You fucking tell him, you fucking moron! You're a racist. What? What? You don't like me because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Excuse like me. That. Wait. That oh, wait, boy. I, I, I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on, um... Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? Gotcha. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, Mr. Kenneth, were we at uh, financing?
Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simeon? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Just cause you have a massive gaper, bitch! You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. No, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Don't look around. Take me where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on his fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. Fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Yateri. So this businessman, he looked legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out.
Hey, man, it's Jess up here. Okay, stop the car. Pull up. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. Hey, darling, I ain't seen you for Ram now. it already. Hey, Mr. Sammy, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! Simeon Yaterian doesn't back down for... I know people you know! Be an honest criminal! Recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? <laughs> you fucking. Oh. I'll tell you something. This thing's gonna need some serious body work for it's worth five grand a month. Ah, <laughs> uh, he agreed to financing. I have his signature. Yeah. Did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I thought. Oh, I... Uh. That kid might be a fucking idiot. But you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Ugh. Don't make me have to come back here. here as soon as possible not a problem a driver's on the way great say again how the fuck we get fired man it was partly all that bullshit you pulled and partly the repos old man making me crash the car into the dealership. Ha! <laughs> you the crazy ass motherfucker in this partnership. You better spend them while you got them. Yeah, if you say so.
cab as soon as you can. No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. Appreciate it. Where do you want to go? Rockford Hills. I'll get you there fast, buddy. This is the spot, right? What do you want? Man, I'll come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give this shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately. And maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you're gonna rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. 
All right, man. I'm following you. <laughs>